We see that the station is at the center of the VSK, and on the video camera and the image. The International Space Station growing ever larger in the field of view, with the Soyuz now just 1.6 kilometers away, closing at a rate of 4 meters per second. At the time of the final approach and contact and capture, the Soyuz will be traveling at a glacial rate of about one-tenth of a meter per second uh, for contact and capture to minimize uh, the rates imposed on the uh, International Space Station at the point of docking. We confirm combined gas, so we confirm thrust activation, range is 740 and range rate is 2.3 meters per second. All of uh, the approach burns and engine firings uh, pre-programmed into the Soyuz computer have uh, been executed flawlessly, no issues, as uh, the International Space Station and the Soyuz fly over the South Pacific, about to begin a southwest to northeasterly track that will carry it across the coast of Chile a short time from now. Having completed its fly around to the International Space Station and now station keeping at a distance of uh, 200 meters away, uh, we are about uh, to receive uh, the final command for the terminal approach of the Soyuz uh, to the International Space Station, a good view of that Soyuz vehicle from external cameras on the International Space Station. Select the ruler here. The target is low by one degree. The crosshairs are almost aligned. We got me. Range is 25 meters. Got me. This is Mission Control Koryov. Uh, the Soyuz now less than 20 meters away. One uh, final uh, maneuver to fine tune uh, its alignment uh, to the Rossviad module's docking target, closing at a rate of one tenth of a meter per second. We are standing by now for contact and capture of the International Space Station. Uh, the target is in the center, the crosshairs are aligned, and we are in the final approach. 3.5 squares. We see the target, 4 squares. We confirm mechanical. Contact confirmed and capture confirmed. The Soyuz MSO-3 has arrived at the International Space Station. Docking occurring at 3.58 p.m. Central Time, 3.58 p.m. Central Time, 4.58 p.m. Eastern Time. On the 18th anniversary of the launch of the first module of the International Space Station, Expedition 50 has a full complement of crew members.